Iraqi Ministry of Foreign Affairs Senior Undersecretary Abdul Karim Hashim on Friday, July 24, called for Saudi Arabia to put in protocols to facilitate Iraqi or travel of Iraqi nationals to the kingdom and boost investment. During a meeting in Riyadh with Saudi Arabian Deputy Foreign Minister for Political and Economic Affairs Adel Murdad on the sidelines of a session of the Iraqi-Saudi Coordination Council, Hashim said he was pleased that relations were developing between or were developing between their two countries, particularly in recent years. According to a readout of the meeting published by the Iraqi Foreign Ministry, Hashem put forward a number of proposals, including for facilitating the movement of travelers, abolishing entry fees for investors and business people between the two countries, and benefiting from successful Saudi experiences in several areas where Iraq needs to develop its capabilities. Mordad expressed his appreciation of the positive vision presented by the Iraqi officials and said that his country was ready to strengthen bilateral relationships. The development of relations between our two brotherly countries will have great benefits for our two peoples in various fields and it will be a source of political, economic and security stability in the region, he said. Iraqi Prime Minister Mustafa al qadimi had been set to visit Saudi Arabia on Monday but the visit was postponed when King Salman was admitted to the hospital with an inflamed gallbladder.